Good morning everybody. It is very early in the morning and we have woken up to thick snow. I literally can't believe it. I'm just going to show you my garden at how thick it is. If you can see on the stairs, we've literally got so much snow. Um, obviously so unexpected. Happy Vlogmas, very on topic with the snow and it's literally two weeks till Christmas. Um, but today's vlog was meant to be me jumping Albie. That won't be happening, so I've changed it to a day in the life of me at the stables in the snow. A snowy stable routine because, like I said, I've had to get up early because my car just will not make it to the yard. Um, I've got like a low down small car, so I will literally be God knows where if I try to get that out of my drive. Um, so I'm having to go with my cousin. Obviously she goes to the stables as well because she's got horses. She's got a big car, so we're going to drive together. Um, we're just going to go get it done early. God knows how thick it is at the yard because obviously the yard doesn't get driven on all night like the roads do here, so it's probably going to be so snowy there. Um, so yeah, I mean, snow is always a little bit hectic with the horses. So Krem's first time in the snow with me. I don't know if he's ever seen snow. He probably has, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, it's Boo and Albie's second. I can't believe we've had snow t like two times in the last two years. It's crazy. But yeah, early morning start, I need to wrap up, I've got all my layers on already and I need to go put my coat and boots on because it's going to be a very cold morning um, and a bit of a stressful morning. So I will show you us driving there and once we get there. Oh my goodness, I did not expect it to be this thick. I have just had to have a fight with my gates to get them open got my coffee and I'm having to go meet my cousin because she can't get to my house so I'm now walking to the car but look how thick it is like, honestly I can't believe this <laughs> we was not expecting this snow You've seen snow many of times, haven't you? You can't. Come on, darling.
Christmas for you and me If I told you 
Oh! I just had him, but he's run off from me. <laughs> Ooh. Sis, look. Sis. Sis. Just try and don't let him go. Yeah. Just try and not let him go past us. Yeah, you sure? Whoa, 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 whoa. There you go, quick, shut it. Quick, shut it. Quick, just pick it up. <laughs> just pick it up. Quick. Right. Oh, oh, oh. Well. You go back in your stable for it, little boy. Come on then. Bella.
Good morning everybody from another very very snowy day. So I'm really sorry, yesterday I didn't even get to do an outro. It was such a rush because obviously I didn't I couldn't drive my car so I had to just get the lift that I could get and yeah getting the horses done in the snow it took so long it was stressful I'm gonna be honest. Um, I've got a very unhappy Albie behind me because he cannot believe that he's not allowed out in the field. So I'm going to put the horses out in the field today with some hay um, just to get, their, get them out of the stables because mine just don't do well standing in. <laughs> God forbid they actually had to stay in their stables for a specific reason because I just won't do it. They're just, they've been in terrible moods for the last 24 hours. Everyone's been telling me they're not eating their hay because they're stropping. Albie had a strop yesterday with his water bucket and broke it and the whole water went over the stable when I was not here and I couldn't get here because I didn't have a car to drive. Anyway. This has gone from a day at stables in the snow to 24 hours in the snow. We've got a very, very exciting day today, minus the snow. Really could have done without the snow, to be honest, on today's day, but we've got to work, make it work because Christmas is coming up and then it's the new year and we need to get this appointment in. Our new saddle arrives today. So the lovely Sophie from Albion will be turning up. And um, she, if you go back down my videos, you'll see when Albion first come to visit me um, to measure creme um, ready to make my saddle. And I chose everything there and then and designed it. So I'm really scared. I haven't, and when I say this, honestly, hand on heart, I haven't seen one single snippet or a photo or anything. Like I'm so scared because I chose this all myself and just went, yeah, yeah, that looks nice. Yeah, that will be nice. So I'm just praying that my designs actually look nice and not bad i don't know i'm scared really really scared but that arrives today so today's plan get the horses out in the field hopefully safely as it's very slippy out but in the actual field it's just nice thick snow so they'll just be able to have a roll and i'll put some hay out for them to eat get the jobs done and then sophie will be arriving and we do luckily have an indoor school here so i should be able to ride in my new saddle um to try it out and i'm just so excited so yeah Welcome to 24 hours in the snow with us. Um, the snow has not budged. It's still just as thick, just as, I mean, I love snow. It's very, very pretty, but with horses, it's just a little bit inconvenient and makes everything a little bit harder. But do you know what? It's pretty and it's Christmas, so we should be thankful. Oh, you're not happy. You're not happy. I'll come, let me get you out. I better get these ponies out in the field. Steady, please. Steady Al. Ah, steady. I mean, look how frozen the water bucket is. There's literally no budge in that. It's gone straight to the high. I thought it was going to have a roll. Alps? You're not going to have a roll? He's like, Mum, I've seen snow before. Stop making a big deal out of it. You going to have a roll? Oh, no, we're going to go to the other, the other high because we, we have to be like that. <laughs> it's literally so deep, guys. Honestly, we've not had snow like this here in years. You gonna have a roll? Good boy. Oh, that's probably very cold. Ah, ah, steady. <laughs> you silly pony. Silly pony. I think he's a little bit confused. I'm gonna have a roll. Look how deep the snow is with his little legs. <laughs> that is so funny. When 
I, the, the thing is, when I walk off, he will then roll and do all the funny stuff like Albie did, and I didn't catch any of it on camera. <sighs> don't play in the snow. Go on. No, don't bite mummy. Mummy doesn't have anything for you. I'm escaping now. Have fun. Okay, I decided in the end to just put the horses out separate whilst I'm mucking them out so they can all have like an hour each. Doesn't take me an hour to muck out, but <laughs> I've gone slow so they can get some time out because I just think Albie just, I didn't actually catch it on camera because I took my camera off, but he just went a bit crazy. He was literally, all four legs were off the floor at one point and I just thought it's really not going to be necessary to put creme out here. They both set each other off and um, we have injuries in the snow. It's just not what I need right now. <laughs> So, Albie's had probably a good hour out here, bless him. I'm just gonna get him in now. I think he's eating the snow. I've actually just noticed. Are you eating snow? <laughs> he actually is eating the snow. Um, I'm gonna get him in and then put creme out. Hopefully he behaves. Excuse me. Have you just been eating all of that pile? <laughs> Excuse me. Is that your new snack? Oh, is that your new snack? You're going to be a good boy to come in because she was very... <laughs> Look at your whiskers. That's it, get it all over mummy. Mummy's cold enough. You're actually eating all the snow, you silly boy. Oh, silly pony. Ready to come in? Come in then. Crummy. A lot more sensible than Alb's was, that's for sure. Gonna have a roll. Oh, Eddie! Maybe not more sensible than Alb. <laughs> Steady, please. Steady, please. Good boy. Hi guys, so the horses are all in now. Krim hated being out in the snow. I really don't know why, but I had to quickly get him in because he was going absolutely crazy. So he's in, he's chilling, he's been groomed. Um, just chilling with Albs. Albs doesn't really know what he wants to do. Don't know if he really liked being out. I don't know if he wants to be in. He doesn't want to eat his hay. He's just being a very spoiled little pony that has got the ump. I mean, you don't like the snow. You're angry with the snow, aren't you? No, at least they all got out. Um, Albie had a good hour to stretch his legs. Boo had a little time. Boo wasn't bothered. Boo was happy just to come in. Um, but they all got out and stretched their legs and I'm just waiting for Sophie. I'm so excited. I've got my old Albie in here ready to trade in. Um, it's not old. This is literally a brand new saddle. Oh, excuse me. Uh, uh, Mummy's talking. This is literally a brand new saddle. I, I have loved riding in this saddle. Um, I am gonna be honest. I want to say this is the K, the K, oh, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, I'm gonna ask Sophie exactly what this one was called. But I have loved riding in this. Um, it is still pretty much brand new. Um, so yeah, I give this back and get my brand new saddle. Which, it's not for you, it's for Creme. But I am very, very excited for. So she should be here any minute. I'm just waiting. Okay, Sophie's arrived and <laughs> the saddle's here. And I'm so excited to see it. So I've not opened it or seen it at all. This is the first time. Okay. You're a little bit nervous. <laughs> uh, I'm really nervous. Okay. It's all down to me. Oh my goodness. Okay. So you've got. Take this off and have a proper look. Oh wow. So you've got obviously 
a cupboard saddle that is covered leather. Yeah. You've got your cream or your, your nude stitch line, um, your little bit of nude. Yeah, and I love that. that. You wear well. Oh, oh my God, I love this. Back. I love that we went through on the Yeah, so well. for you guys, you can see the underneath. We've got a nice little main page. Yeah, that's there. I suppose. You could do a close. Yeah, I'll do a close. I'll show it everyone in a minute. Oh, no, you won't have a look too. Oh, my God. Oh, and my name here. Oh, I love it. Oh, no, I'm really, really, really Happy? pleased. Really, really <laughs> pleased. I'm so, oh, I'm so, so it's, glad. It's really subtle where you've gone for, but it's really nice. Yeah, like I so couldn't remember if I, if I did the cream here or yeah. not, and I was thinking, oh, I've So, like, from else. the back, it is really, really pretty. That looks so lovely. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm really, really pleased. Do you like it? Yeah, we all, all of us at the factory love it. It's really, oh, really, really smart. Nice. Yeah. Really, really smart. Um, and obviously, the in the K2, this is the first time we've had one covered as well. So, um, oh, yeah, because we've done the extra. Yeah, yeah, of course. So, so it's basically like no one else has got this saddle. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it's like my it's own very saddle. much your own. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I absolutely love it. Just got to go fish it to creme now. I'm so excited. Can I touch it? Yeah, of course. It looks so comfy. So comfy. I'm glad I went for this leather. Yeah. Because it's so much more softer. Oh, it's just a lot bigger to, to that saddle. Like, it feels bigger. <laughs> um, I was trying to explain what that saddle was called. What was that called? So that's the control. The control. Yeah, it's the control. Because I, I really enjoyed riding that, and I was trying to explain what it was called. <laughs> I'm really happy with this, because I didn't know what that was going to be like. Yeah. But I love the name flat. It feels so nice. See, and then rather than, which I kind of glad we didn't, you could have had the new over there, but you yeah. didn't. So obviously, again, it keeps it all really elegant. Yeah, like, it looks, that's what, what I was worried about. I love all the cream, but I thought one day I might get a bit sick of it, whereas yeah. this is like, very it's enough, subtle. isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's enough to like be seen. Oh, I absolutely love it. I'm so pleased. It's amazing. <laughs> okay, should we go and put it on him? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm interested to see if he's changed. It would be really good. It's like you say, he has still got a lot of muscle to build, but he definitely has changed, I think. Well, I think anyway. Maybe <laughs> Could be wrong. It's full. Oh dear. <laughs> scary. What's your scary lady? What's she doing in your house? So what is she doing in your bedroom? Oh really? That's strange. <laughs> it's so wider. No. And then centimetres round, he's exactly the same as the It's the hand, darling. <laughs> She's not hurting you, is she? No, but oh my goodness, she just put that thing on me. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. <laughs> um, but like you say, time of year. So I've seen you literally in the summer. Yeah. So it has just gone quite cold, so it could be that. Um, and then obviously, from everything you described, obviously before. Yeah. So he's just going back into it, but yeah. Love it now. And don't put your ears back. You're not that type of horse. <laughs> Pretending that you're going to be nasty. <laughs> because so I don't understand what's going on there. I know. He's like, I know she's going to prop me with an injection or something. Yeah, it? at some point, it's going to change. At some point, you're going to be like the vet. I know, darling. I promise you, I'm not going to. You're all right. <laughs> you're okay. I promise. <laughs> Can you see now? Look at you, Hmm, I don't trust you. Yeah, you have a clipboard. You have a clipboard and you could stop it. Are you acting like you've been sedated now? <laughs> Look at it. It's like you've touched oh, me. <laughs> okay. Just this again. Same thing. One more. That's it. You're okay, you're very clever. Is it okay? Well, you're a funny thing, Crem. The face he's feeling, you think it's, it's hurting it's him. Been you honestly. Even how good you are, and you're terrified to get up apparently today. Oh, that was a good old crunch, wasn't it? Yeah, that was a This is the last one. It's not hurting you, Krem. Come on. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Done. You. All done. You're very clever. Good boy. <laughs>
This is T18, so the back template, that's kind of here or net, there really, so that's yeah. around about the same. Um, and you can see just how he's kind of trimmed up through A, so two inches of scrap yard, and then trimmed up a little bit through B. Um, you could put this down to loads of things, so obviously you've been working him a lot harder than when he arrived, so obviously yeah. he could have like fittened up. Um, also time of year, when I seen you was summertime, and now kind of quite deep into yeah. winter um, so you tend to find that horses will drop a little bit over that sort of time of year yeah. um, so very very normal the good thing is circumference round he's no different so he hasn't actually lost any condition and he still okay, looks great. fantastic um, as you commented anyway it's still just probably a little bit more top line to develop yeah. um, but that's that's to come yeah perfect how embarrassing I thought you'd changed this changed <laughs> you just got slit thinner it's got trimmer not really what I expected. Again, you could put it down, like I say, you could go Yeah, winter, it is winter. More toned, winter. There's so many things it can be. Um, and obviously, depending on how much you did drop, and obviously slowly bring it back up yeah. to, to, to where he is now. Yeah. Oh, pretty boy. But, yeah. <laughs> it is going to be cold leather on your back, buddy. Creme, um, come on. <laughs> all right darling it's okay it's a brand new saddle it's very special you're very spoiled good boy <gasps> wow look <laughs> oh creamy look how smart you look And then we fit in this one with the sheepskin or fit in this with the thin? Um, I don't know, what do you think? Um, it, it really, it's whatever you want me to fit it with. So it just depends on, because I just need to change, like, modify the pattern. So if, if I do it without the sheepskin, I can't wear the sheepskin or other way around? Yeah, so at the moment, it's kind of, if you want to use the sheepskin while you're in winter, where he's a little bit on, on the finer side, and then obviously as he bulks out, and obviously everything's going to bed yeah. saddle-wise, you could then obviously go to the thin in the summer. So it depends which other So would you be able to change up the summer then? Yeah, yeah. So obviously the thing at the moment is you've got one, you've got your adjustable saddle. Yeah. And so this can be obviously adjusted in the width so we could widen it or we can narrow it depending yeah. on what his shape does. And then you've got a flop panel so we yeah. can obviously adjust the panel to him as well. Yeah. So at the moment we need to pop a little bit of flock in because yeah. again this is just as, as yeah, it yeah, comes yeah. on the factory. So we need to obviously just adjust a few little things to him. Um, and then for me, I just need to work with the pad that you're going to be using. Yeah, I think let's go sheepskin. I do like riding in a sheepskin. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. Um, and then obviously this being a new saddle, we want to book you back in to recheck it in around about kind of 10 to 12 weeks. Okay. Um, to get it on. So I can always take it off then if I exactly. want to. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and then that'll be coming into spring as well. So Perfect. then that'll just catch the seasonal change. Let's do that. And a nice bit of wool for you. So what is the difference between the dark colour wool and the light colour wool? So there are two different types of wool um, and then obviously you've got different textures and densities of fibre and lengths. Yeah. So if you see when I pull this one apart, yeah. it'll be quite difficult to kind of, uh, you'll feel it in yeah, a second. Yeah, yeah. So that's a white wool. And then you've got your Jacob's wool. So why would you use different? So you have to match what's already in the saddle. So different oh, okay. manufacturers will use. So Albion use a Jacobs wool. Oh, so okay. we'll obviously pop a Jacobs wool back in. If you mix the two, what you'll find is they'll work against each other and then they'll ball up and they'll cause basically lumps, yeah. which we obviously don't want. Um, some brands of saddle also use um, a synthetic type of wool. Um, so this one, you can see, oh, yeah, yeah. really quite short fibres, it almost like falls apart. Yeah. Um, so that's a synthetic. So yeah, you never want to mix your wool. Okay. Cool. I'm going to have a go now at flocking one of the saddles. I've never done it before and I'm definitely not professional, but I'm just going to have a go for a bit of fun. Okay, so you said pull it long. Yeah. All of this? So maybe some of a smaller piece, but a little bit longer. <laughs> okay. So like this? Yeah. And then you've got to get your flocking iron. Are you all the same? So they're different lengths and then obviously different angles. I'll probably start with that one. Yeah. Put it on the end? Yeah. And then feed it through, there's a little flocking hole in the panel. So, I want to go on top of this, yeah? Yeah. Why do you look like you can do it so fast? So I can't. 
It's probably, it's, it's all about feel, so it's obviously I've been doing it for years, so it's a, yeah, a lot harder probably than you yeah. <laughs> think it looks. But I can feel what I've just put in, to yeah. be fair. That's actually really cool. Can I put this in? Yeah. Yeah, it's got a bit of pain. That's right. Lucky person. <laughs> Can you like ever put too much in? Yeah, so we don't want to ever overfill a panel. If we yeah. overfill a panel, it'll become hard. Yeah. Um, and then that's obviously when it can cause a bit of an issue to a horse's back. So you can cause yeah. bruising or it can actually cause us to bounce too much. Okay. Oh, thank you. So, How do you feel the saddle went? I am so pleased. I literally feel like I'm in an armchair, which is exactly how I felt when I tried the K2 out. It feels different because the control that I've been riding in obviously is a different saddle. Um, I feel a lot more high up because obviously this is brand new and just been flopped. Um, but just so comfortable. I literally don't move out of the saddle. Um, obviously, I've, like I said, I've got some adjusting to do and getting used to it. Um, don't judge my riding as it is a brand new saddle. So <laughs> I did feel a little bit strange, but overall I'm so pleased. Absolutely love the way it looks. So happy with the design, how it came out. And yeah, I'm so comfy and can't wait to have a little jump in this also. guys update <laughs> I am frozen to the bone like frozen my feet I can't actually feel my toes however Sophie has now gone and um, I am so pleased with my saddle like I was so nervous because I changed a couple of things like I first said yep do everything cream and then I messaged and I was like mm, I'm a bit worried that's gonna look you know too much and I don't need all the cream um, but I'm so, so pleased with how it's turned out. 
I'm like I said, I'm freezing, um, but I'm going to take it home anyway because I don't want to leave it unstable because it will get ruined. Um, so I'll give you a proper debrief when I get home. Like I'll show a nice little video um, so you can see all the little extras that I added. Um, but that is what I love so much about Albion. Like you literally, could, I, I was like, well, what should I do then? I was like, you can choose everything. Like you can have a whole pink saddle if you want. I was like, really? <laughs> Um, they sent leather samples out to me like of the cream so I could choose the cream like honestly they really are so special and make the experience really special and unique to you and like I said so personal like that saddle no one has that saddle and um, that is a K2 but K2s don't actually look like that because I love the look of the K4 but I didn't like riding in the K4 the K4 is their like brand new saddle or maybe I'll attach an image here because it's like their brand new jump saddle it's very very sporty very very show jumpy um, a little bit too much for me and it was just I need more of a general purpose. Not a general purpose, but more of a comfy jump saddle. Um, which is why I love the K2. The K2 is so comfy also, like so, so pleased with it. Um, it's just like an armchair. Like it's, it is sometimes hard to get a nice soft saddle that is a jumping saddle and this is just perfect. Um, but yeah, they made this whole experience so unique to me. I chose every single thing and they have made it just how I wanted, like more than I even imagined. Um, so I'm so pleased. So thank you so much to my amazing sponsors, Albion. Um, this is not a free saddle. This is not me bragging about this new brand new free saddle that I've just been gifted. I've, you know, fully paid for my saddle, but I've worked closely with Albion um, and they're a great company and I'm so pleased that I went with them. So I've been waiting for this day all year, the coldest day of the year with snow, but we made it happen. Thankfully, we have an indoor school here where I am um, and we got to have a little ride. But I am now going to go home because when I say I am frozen, so I'm just waiting to be picked up. I feel really young again when I used to get wait to get picked up at the yard. <laughs> um, but my ears, my toes, my fingertips are frozen. Like my toes, I actually think I can't move them. So I'm scared for that horrible burning pain I'm going to get when I touch the bath when I get home. You know that feeling. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed vlogmas number three. <clears throat> I'm going to try and get as many vlogmases out this year as I can. December's busy, but I'm going to do my best. And the snow has really thrown a spanner in the works because I had a lot more planned that I now can't do because of the snow. So hopefully this lovely, pretty snow burns away quick, melts away quick, sorry, shall I say. And we can get on with some more fun vlogmases. But I'll see you in the next one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this one. Al was eating his dinner as he would come and say bye. Say bye, boys. <laughs> thank you guys don't forget to like subscribe and please follow me on instagram thank you so much